We're looking at our downtown Palm Springs cam at a beautiful fall evening. Temperatures are now in the 70s as we dip into our evening temperatures. Looking at across the valley, we're seeing uh, 78 degrees in Palm Springs, 76 in Cathedral City, and 73 in La Quinta. So things are feeling nice, cool, and seasonable. Our winds are very calm right now. We're seeing, if anything, just a bit of a breeze in certain areas, and our dew points are nice and low, way below under 50 perfect for this time of year so things are shaping up to be nice cool and dry for the end of our week and these nice conditions are going to be sticking around for this holiday weekend now we only have three more days to go for Halloween and I know you're asking is it going to be good trick-or-treating weather is it going to be good last-minute pumpkin shopping weather and the answer is yes we're going to be staying in the 80s for all of this weekend even into Monday we're looking at a high of 84 degrees on Saturday 87 on Sunday and for Halloween 87 degrees as well so great trick-or-treating weather is on the way but I am tracking big changes on the way as well now right now we are we have a first alert weather alert day in place due to we are tracking some gusty winds rain and even snow in some high elevation areas a big part of that is because of a front of low pressure that is going to be coming in now right now we're not seeing much activity here is a satellite map we are seeing some cloud cover rolling in from the northwest but but not much activity is going on as we saw earlier. It's nice, cool, and calm. However, come Tuesday, we will see this front of low pressure move in from the northwest, and along with some cooler temperatures, we will see gustier conditions, some potential rainfall, as well as snow in high elevation areas, and we'll be tracking that for you throughout the week. Now, looking at our first alert comfort air seven day forecast, again, we are going to have a nice, cool, and calm holiday weekend as heading into Halloween, but we do have a first alert weather alert day in place for Wednesday and Thursday as we do see some uh, some gustier and rainier conditions coming in. You were, you were watching the Desert's News Leader. I'm Ken Copper and 